Welcome everybody, challenge series number four, challenge number three, manual four spaces to a shove it, goes like this. A little tip for this trick, when you're setting up to do your manual, I don't set up how I would normally set up for a manual, I set up how I do a shove it. And then I hold my manual in that position so that it makes it easier to do the shove it out. When you do the shove it out, you really gotta flick it a lot more than a regular shove it. And you'll see, you'll get it. It's, it's a little tricky, but it's a fun one. All right, when I set up for this, I kinda put the ball of my foot right on the very end of the tail, like way back here. That makes it easier to do the shove it. So then, you just gotta figure out how you're gonna hold your manual like that. You just gotta get comfortable with that. And then when you go to do the shove it, it's a lot easier to flick. If you don't have grip tape on the nose and tail of your dervish, I recommend it. it helps a lot with not only shove its but manuals and linking them together. And when you put grip tape on, you just want to make sure that you sand off the original spray grip and then just put a little patch on the nose and tail. Should help out. All right, so this move you might want to practice in steps. First, to learn how to do the manual for parking spaces and then learn your shove it. And if you're having trouble with the shove it, there's a trick tip. It's up there on the web. You can find it, have faith. And good luck with this one. Signing out. Signing out. The bearded mountain man.